Welcome to the Potter Blog site, August 12, 2013. If you're one of the very few people who's actually going to watch this video, uh, you're one of the very few people who understand, outside the quarter, corridors of power, how significantly the federal government is preparing for an H7N9 pandemic to hit this year and in the coming years. Uh, today, on Federal Biz Ops, the uh, CDC is releasing a contract uh, to support a national nurse triage line during a severe influenza pandemic. And basically what they're doing here is they're trying to come up with a way to uh, keep people from going to the hospital and uh, how to, who to call when H7N9 hits your family. So what they're doing is they're looking to contract with United Way for their 211 phone service. So you would call 211 on your phone and you would actually be connected with, as you see in the second contract here, a poison control nurse who's been trained to uh, figure out how to triage your case of H7N9 bird flu. So this should give you some idea of how significantly the federal government is uh, preparing for an H7N9 uh, influenza pandemic. I mean, this is these are significant preparations. Uh, also recently in one of their uh, solicitations, they've had this note here in red, it says, due to the urgency of ongoing preparedness activities for a influenza A H7N9 virus, available funding for awards uh, may be limited. Plus, they're going to give favoritism to uh, uh, systems that uh, concentrate on the H H7N9 virus. So, as we say here on our website, now let's go to that real quick. Is that... They're basically setting this up to avert panic. And we list here the solicitations. Now, despite our own belief that there's a low risk of, wide, of a widespread high fatality bird flu pandemic this year, the massive preparations the federal government is undertaking for just such an occurrence can only be foolish, foolishly ignored. And what we've done here is what we, we've shown here what we recently purchased the following types of items to cost effectively risk mitigate. This expected outbreak. Now, we believe these things offer a Darwinian advantage if there is a severe pandemic. Uh, in those regards, the Thanksgiving turkey may also be coming off our menu as turkeys have a history of H7N9 in the United States. Now we show three things here, uh, chlorhexidine, gluconate, hippoclens, uh, P100 masks, specifically P100 if you're going to look for a mask, and then a home-based uh, HEPA filter. Uh, the HIPAA cleanse, as we discussed in detail, and we have links on our site, uh, just basically makes the coating on your skin. Uh, it's a surgical wash that keeps killing bugs for six hours after you wash with it. Uh, these other two things are things that are, you know, if you're going to have somebody sick in your home, this is going to help keep it from spreading. And we're going to go all of this in much more detail later. But... Uh, uh, key thing to, to take away from this is that the government is making massive preparations. It's just unbelievable the amount of money they're spending and the efforts they're going through to prevent panic for when this stuff hits. Let's hope they're wrong.